Hello people, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you some cool things to try on Wolfram. So the first thing that I'm going to um, show you is by using Wolfram language input, which is the default one. And I'm, let me just delete this. For the commands, you don't actually need to put input and then number, it'll just do that for you. So it's cloud deploy, manipulate, rotate, style, and then quotation marks, hello, and then all these numbers over here. And then you're gonna press shift, enter. And then once it loads, it'll show you this link. I'm just gonna copy that. And then let's go to a new tab and paste. So it'll take you to also a website on Wolfram and it'll show you whatever word or sentence you put in the quote and then you can manipulate its angle using this meter or dial or whatever you want to call it and it'll rotate it. You can replace like the word hello with any sentence or word that you want as long as you put it inside the quotes next to style. The next thing that I want to show you is also on Wolfram language input, which is the default one. Let me just copy this. This is my draft over here, all of this stuff. And then go back to, wrong tab, okay. Go back to here and delete that input thing. And go over there, shift, enter it will show you the first 100 digits of pi. Let's copy this again. Go to another, get another section, also Wolfram language input default. Paste it and let's change 100 to 1000. Oops, okay. There we go. And shift, enter. It will show you the first 1000 digits of pi. And the next one that I want to show you is actually pretty interesting. It did show the command that I used in the tutorial, but it showed like a picture of something else and I decided that I want to try it. So this one you're going to do this equal, single equal sign in a gray box. You're going to click that. And then type picture. Okay, picture of a dog, shift enter, and it will show you a picture of a dog. Let me just enlarge that a bit. It's kind of pixely. So in the tutorials, they did picture of a dog and stuff like that. Let me try picture of a, let's try panda, shift enter. It will load an image of a panda the same size as the last time that you enlarged one. So this one is kind of something that I found out on my own a bit. In the tutorial it showed like picture of a cat, picture of a dog, but I wanted to see like what else could they show a picture of. So for this one you're going to type picture of a and then you're going to type your name and then hit shift enter and this is what it gave me it's kind of like this mountain range with a weird design in the top right corner I don't exactly know what it is but this is what it gives Clara so okay and let's test something else I kinda wanted to see like in the tutorials they only did basic animals but I wanted to see like what else could it show can it show names or what else can it show so let's try a picture um, of a planet shift enter it 
and those are some and it will show you these eight planets and anyways guys that's it for today if you like this video or you want a part two make sure to hit that like button and subscribe and I will put all the commands that I used in the description okay bye